All right, we're back with some upgrades. Got me some oatmeal. Was looking around and I couldn't find anything. And the only thing I saw was some oatmeal. I'm like, you know what? Good enough for me. Please don't interrupt the show. Call that a show? Sounding more like a dying pig dying. Uh, dying pig calling out for its mama. Dying pig dying. Oi. Don't you think, buddy? Mm. I think that's a bit extreme. Extreme is right. It ain't just bad. It's straight up noise pollution. I'd rather jam pencils into my eardrum than have to listen to the, another note of his bullshit. Noise pollution. Huh? You heard me right, Piggy. Ain't no other word for it. I know music and that vile shit wasn't it. So why don't you go on home if you keep spewing that filth into my airwaves? I'm gonna have to get nasty. Wait, please. Boy. Hey, cut the kid some slack. Huh? Excuse me, I'm really sticking up for some tone desk stack of yodels? Well, fine. If I gotta silence you to silence him, then... Then you leave me no choice. Bring it. <laughs> Bitch. <laughs> so mean. Take that angry man. First I get my ears split open by that terrible music, then I get my face split open by this asshole. What a fucking day. Thanks a ton. How am I ever gonna repay ya? Yeah. No thanks needed. Besides, you seem a little down on your luck. Be to be offering anything. Ain't that the truth? I'm Takyo Yoshioka, by the way. Good. Freaking toasty in here. Cure you, you've been singing here long? Yeah. Just started a couple days ago. I used to busk on the other side of town, but some punk got on my case and handed my ass to me. Oh, my thing says it's 81 degrees. That's hot. But some punk got on my case and handed my ass to me. See the cuts on my face? That was his handiwork. Seems like everywhere I go, there's always someone trying to keep me down. Oh, got it rough, kid. Ah, no need to pity me. I mean, I have ears. I could tell I suck. But music means the world to me. Whenever life's gotten me down, music has been there to pull me back up. That's why I write songs. If my music can help someone who's stuck in the same rut as me, then I feel like I've made a difference, you know? So you compose your own work? Sure do. When I get a guitar in my hands, the melodies just spring forth from my fingers like magic. Can't even count how many songs I've written. That's impressive. This talent is born from that kind of dedication. <laughs> Thanks, it means a lot. Actually, I've even auditioned for a few major record labels. But they kept dropping me mid-session. Said my songs were great, but my voice dragged them down into the gutter. Hmm. I wish I could give my message out to a larger audience, but there's no way, not with a voice like mine. Man, doesn't matter how good my songs are, when you've got a voice like a horse, the music dies. Maybe. Maybe I'm not cut out for this. Yeah. That's not true. If you weren't, you wouldn't have endured all this beatings just to stick with it. If that's not love, I don't know what it is. You can never abandon music. Yeah, you're right. Sorry for whining like a little bitch. I'm gonna keep trying. 
Music is my life after all. Might suck, but I love. <laughs> Glad you came around. Thank you so much for hearing me out. I'm here performing pretty often, so swing by sometime. Uh, I'll sing a song for you. I might sound like nails on the chalkboard, but I put my nails into them. Oh, I put my nails, but I put my heart into every note I sing. Uh. Sounds good. I'll see you around. <laughs> Can't wait. Fog. Oh, we got another. Uh, Eat action. Oh. Essence of your essence thing. There's a guy playing piano right there. Or piano. Guitar. And literally like around the corner another guy playing that guitar. Take this asshole. Okay, and these guys are rich. Oof. Dead. Ooh, fuckers. Metal gloves. Black belt. Bust amulet. Modded stove. Modded stove, what? Well, oh, yeah. see what the black belt does. Boost growing ability. Get your hands off me. Oh. Uh. Oh, that's funny. You were totally asking for this there to go. The only thing I was asking for was directions. Sure, sure. No need to be modest now. I know what you're really after is a little action. Ugh, gross. Hmm. What? 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 You got a little meat on your bones, but eh. Beggars can't be choosers. Am I right? <laughs> now let's get out of here and have some fun. I'm not going anywhere with you. Just leave me alone. Listen, I'm getting tired of this attitude. I'm gonna have to teach you how things work around here. 
Besides, where's the nobody like you gotta be in such a hurry, huh? Come on, we'll show you just how great this city is. We're experts with our hands, you know. Because that's all we do is jerk ourselves off. It'll be a special night, I promise. Those thugs are going to hurt that girl. Help the girl. Boy. Hey, you guys are pathetic. Can't you tell that she's not interested? Did it look like we were asking you for your opinion, old man? Please, sir. Help me. Ah, some kind of jacked up host, huh? Either way, you uh, shouldn't try to play the hero. I think she'll give you a piece of the action if you save her. Is that it? Sorry to break it to you, but we got dibs. Go take a nap or something, old man. Or do we gotta make you go? Uh. Oh, I missed my opportunity. Bitch. Oh. In your face, you ass, oh, bitch, ass. I just realized my health is super low. So strong. Still looking for some fun. Because I can keep going. No, no, man. Girls ain't worth getting our ass kicked for this. <laughs> Get out of here. Thank you so much, sir. I've never been so scared. It was nothing. Just be careful who you ask directions for in the, in the future. Can't even ask directions, huh? Not everyone's a good guy in the city like this. Yeah. Totally. I moved here from the country a while back, so I guess I'm still learning a few life lessons. My name is Mika. Miki, by the way. How long have you been here? Three years, actually. I've always dreamed of becoming a singer. I thought coming here to Osaka would be the best bet to hit it big. A singer, huh? Yeah, it hasn't really worked out, though. I know I could sing, but I can't write songs to save my life. Record labels I dished before wouldn't even let me finish. Interesting. Sounds like we have a little thingy bob that we could do here. They say my voice is great, but the songs I was singing were holding me back. Hmm. Sounds familiar, huh? I guess you can't get by on a pretty voice alone these days. I'm not much for looks either, if I'm honest. I can't dance and I can't play in any instruments. Maybe I should just give up and go home. All right, see you later. Bye. But you need to sing. If you can throw yourself behind what you're good at, you got a chance. <gasps> yeah, but I already did. I've tried. Tried so hard. I've been here for three years and I still don't know what's left from right. At some point, it's just not worth it anymore. <laughs> If only I knew someone that shared my passion for music, maybe with a partner, I could get through this and it wouldn't feel so damn hard. That kid with the guitar seemed to have the opposite problem. Maybe these two could hit it up. More ways than one. Lo, lo, lo. I actually know a guy you might want to meet. Musician? Uh. Yeah, his voice is garbage. But his love for music is undeniable. 
You interested? Wow, you really mean it? I'd love to. I bet we'll find him singing in his usual spot up in the... Uh, over there. Cool. Hey. Thanks. I do be singing. Oh, they just disappeared. So this guy, you know, what's his name? Mm -hmm. Uh... Makoto Date. I think it was this one. I think it's Tokyo Yoshiroka. Oh. I'm actually getting kind of nervous now. Mm -hmm. Huh, calm down. He's just a regular guy. Come on. He's the guy over there with the guitar. Okay, here we go. Good luck. Excuse me, um, are you Yoshioka? That melody is incredible. Really? I'm so glad you think so. You even know my name. How's it going over there? Oh, Kurisa. Thanks again for earlier. Are you here to listen to me sing? Nah, your singing sucks. I came to introduce you to this young lady. I'm Miki. It's nice to meet you. Miki-san, huh? You came all the way here from the country to pursue a career in singing. Thought she could use a friend with a mutual interest. Wow, you like music too? I don't know about that. I've failed uh, every audition I've ever had. They always praise their voice though. In that case, I'd love to hear what you got. Can you sing for me? Of course. But I'd rather not perform one of the songs I wrote. They're not very good. That's fine. I got garbage too. Sing whatever you like. A modern day hit, a golden oldie, you name it. How about Rogue of Love? Douche of Love. Oh, everybody loves that one. Let's see what you got. Okay. Here I go. Wow. <laughs> Not bad. Uh, what do you think? I'm floored. I've never heard such a stunning voice before. That scent chills up and down my spine. Oh, come on. Tell me the truth. He's being serious. Even I got lost in how beautiful that sounded. Here you sound. Hearing you sing makes me long even more for pipes like those. Pittle, soothing, warm. With a voice like that, nobody would ever turn me away. I can make so many people happy. Wow, thank you, Yoshioka-san. Hey, uh... What would you like to say that we make music together? Uh -huh. I think I write songs all day, but as soon as I start to sing, everything goes to shit. My voice is garbage. It's so bad that people try to beat me up. As you can tell, my face is literally fucking beat up. But like I said, I can write songs really good, like... Play a few instruments, too. At least that's what I thought until you showed up. Uh, you have to have a lot of passion up through your whole life for a music career. Well, that's exactly why I think we'll work well together. So what do you say? No. <laughs> no. I'm in. I can't wait to see what we can come up with together. Together. Hmm. Yes. Hmm. I'm happy for you, too. Hi. Thank you so much, Kiryu-san. Here, let me give you this. The least I can do for you. Patriarch's bowling ball. Wow, you carry that shit around in your back pocket? Mika-chan and I are gonna climb the charts. This might not be easy, but our passion will carry us through. Uh, good luck, but guys. I can't wait to hear the results. Bye-bye. Can you sight read, Mika-chan? I've got a song we could try out right now. Yeah, let's do it.
Hey, those performances sound amazing. You got that right. Let's go take a listen. Those two will make a great team. And I'm sure it'll be a nice change of pace from getting beat up all the time. Is that the same guy who beat him up earlier? Oh no, they're gone. Bye bye, bye bye. Like a, oh, here it is. Uh, all right, there's two more questies over here, as well as an item pick up. Is it up here? Quiet in here. What is this place? Hey, did you see the news? They're making a Yakuza Sunset 4. Cool. Hmm? Wonder if this will be any good. Sunset 3 cut out all the best parts, you know? Well, that's what happens when you change directors. 1 and 2 were perfect. How could they hope to top them? Beats me, but hey! They're filming this next one right here in Sotabori. I saw them scouting over by Bishamil Bridge. <laughs> yeah, Sirius, come on, let's go! Try and make it in ex extras. I'm ready for my big screen debut. Debut. Wouldn't be much of a debut if uh, you're on screen for two seconds with a single line of dialogue. All right. They're not in a hurry or anything. It sounds like they're shooting a Yakuza movie around here. It's the local locale works. Locale. What's going on here? He's got a knife. Boy. Hey, put that knife down. Leave me alone. I'm gonna run this bastard through and ain't nobody gonna stop me. Let's see what you got, bitch. Alright. Hey, nobody's stabbing anyone today. Just calm down and let's talk about it. None of your goddamn business. I'm... I'm... <laughs> Guess you don't got it in ya. What's going on here? Fuck if I know. Maybe he just runs up to me out of nowhere yelling about how she's gonna kill me. Bet she poured all her cash into a host club and now she's taking it out on the first house she sees. Anyhow, I got a jet. Be careful. You hear? Are you alright? I'm sorry. Why don't you tell me what's going on? Okay, my name is Yuki, uh, Yuriko. Got a sister much younger than me, Miki. Miki? That sounds familiar. Up until last year, she was working here in Sota and Bori. But, she got scammed. The horrible men took everything she had, but not even that was enough for them. One day, they, they kidnapped her, locked her up, abused her, kept her in a cage like some kind of wild dog. It's been a whole year since, and the cops haven't lifted a damn finger. I finally figured out who has her, though. That bastard is one of them. When I saw him, I just couldn't hold it back anymore. I was gonna use this knife and get it back at him for what he did, but I I couldn't muster the courage. 
That was the right choice. Killing that man would find your sister won't find your sister any faster. There are smarter ways to go about that. What's your name? Kiryu. My name is Kiryu Song. You're right, Kiryu Song. Stabbing him at any ain't gonna bring back Miki. This is gonna kind of a long shot, but have you ever seen Miki before? She looks like this. Uh, that's a small picture. I can't see it. Well, yeah. Sorry, I can't say I have. Right. Of course you haven't. Miki and I, we lost our parents long ago. She's the only family I got. I want to help her. But there's still nothing I can do. Cops ignore me. People don't take me seriously. Hell, I don't even have the guts to stab one of the bastards who took her. Here's Dan. I know this is crazy. But could you call me? <laughs> well. Uh, where was I? I know this is crazy for me, but to be asking this, but do you think you can help me find Miki? I'll do anything you want if you manage to find her. Just please save my sea star. Begging you, Kiryu song. Sure. Uh, if it means making you sure you don't end up murdering some guy, I guess. Of course, Kiryu san, thank you very much. Let's talk deets. You said you have info on the guy who kidnapped Miki, right? What do you know? I have pictures. Here. Yagi. Kajiwara. Kojima. 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 First one's a host, name's Yagi. He's the one guy who was just here. He makes his money by targeting lonely single ladies. This guy's the absolute skin of the earth. Second photo is a man named Kajiwara, realtor. At least that's what he calls himself. More like a land shark, if you ask me. Folks around here despise him. As for the last photo, it goes by Kojima. Ain't nobody sure if that's his real name, though. This guy's impossible to pin down. If I had to guess, I'd say he's the one running the whole operation. He looks like a regular old businessman on the outside, but somehow he has one of the richest men in the earth. Country. Oh. No way is he getting all that through legal means. These are the guys who got Miki, I'm sure of it. Okay, let's see what I can find out. Got a real heart of gold, Kyusan. I can't find the words to tell you how much this means to me. First guy, Yagi, is working in the club over on East uh, Shikofuchi Street. Counting on you. Cool. It's down here. Hey guys. I don't have an item. Oh, I have chips on me. Oh yeah, get fucked. I win. Hmm. 
Does this work for something? I don't even know if this actually works. Run here. Aw. I have Mahjong on the brain. is diamond they'd, they'd be packing Goldie. Oh, I could have done some. Maybe. Nah. Literally just a pair. Go, baby. Run here. Aha. Okay.
Yeah, keep keep raising. Oh, you bitch! Got me. I was looking at a pair. I just didn't even notice a straight that was literally in front of me. Oh yeah, let's go. Bullshit. Go baby. Go baby. Damn it. Let's go baby. Let's go. Let's go. Raise it. Raise the stakes, baby. He probably has something better than me, yeah. Cool. Fuck. Alright. Enough of that. Ah, la la la. Oh. Karaoke. A blue bun. Zebra. Whose house is this? Huh. Whoops, my bad. Oh, yep, my bad. Yep, my bad. Enough fiddle farting around. What's up here? Nothing. A peerless tile from Mahjong. Instant wind tile. Why is it always Christmas when I'm 
in this game. I feel like the other Yakuza games are all Christmas as well. Unless it's because of the time of the year that my computer's at. But I don't know. Who knows? Probably always Christmas. Alright, let's play some uh, Mahjong. See if I can win a hand. Yup. Can totally do it. Go get these medium people. Wonderful. I don't want to use that. Just got one. All right, two, three, four. So that's a straight. Six, eight, nine. No. There's a straight right here with the Niners. Get rid of the West Wind. Uh. Six, seven, eight, nine. Get rid of this one. Like I almost have a straight going on there. Two could be a a pair. Uh, six, seven, three, six, nine. Get rid of the nine there. Let's not do that. Get rid of that one. She. I got three of a gun there. Oh, what is that? Two, four, five, six, seven. Get rid of that one. Fuck it. Cheap. Uh. Get rid of eight and nine there. Get rid of that one. I don't really have anything to base off that. Get it. On. So like four, five, six is one. I could probably get rid of eight. Uh oh. Oh no. Ah, oh, he won. White dragon. Okay. I got two pairs there. Is that five, six, seven, nine? Get rid of these ones. Okay. Fuck you too. <laughs> Fuck you, man. He's just pawning everything. Of course, I'll get another thing for that. Dude, he's on a roll. Rid of the nine there. Oh no. 
いい度胸してんな Damn, he's just like No, my points Oh. Yeah, how about that? Nine, yeah, oh, what I got on I know. Cheap. Uh, here's this one. Yeah. Oh no. Chief. On Chi. Oh no, it's Richie. Oh, he just got it. Ah oh, damn. Here. Get rid of that one. So get rid of the D's. They don't have any extra there. Boom. Nine, six, give it a nine one. Cheat. This is, I totally know what I'm doing. Cheat. Cheat. Why can't I put that over there? I should be able to do something with that. It's literally my last one. It's unfortunate. Oh, that's... Run! Alright, I don't care. That was fun for a little bit. I didn't get my money back. <laughs> Screw it. Oh, there's one right there. Man in a cap. No cap. Aw, oh, man. What the hell? Oh, sorry about that. Nah, it was my fault. I can't seem to do anything right. Oh no, he's got a red notice. He dropped it. Boy. Wait, you dropped something. Guess I'll go track him down. <laughs> Who's the Sunset 4? Isn't this the script of the movie those kids were talking about? If the movie's still in production, this must be pretty important. I better track that guy down. It looked like he was heading up the Sotobori Street. Yep. Sotobori. I think that's the guy who dropped the accuser sunset four script. Get back to him. How do I talk to him? Where did he go on this one?
Oi. Hey, aren't you the guy I bumped into on the bridge? Uh. No, I was the one not paying attention. But I'm glad I found you. You dropped this. Don't worry, I didn't read it. Wow, you really tracked me down to give this back? That means a lot. I feel like this Yakuza Sunset thing has a lot of people talking about. A lot of people talking. You must be a pretty big fan. Well, I used to be. Nowadays, I don't know how I feel about it. Mm -hmm. Huh? What do you mean? I'm the director. Daddy. Wait, you're not a fan, but the director of the Yakuza Sunset? That's right. So I've only actually been responsible for one of them so far, Yakuza Sunset 3. And everyone hated it. They wanted to burn it in a dumpster fire. My name is uh, Suga no. Suga, Suga D's. Sugano. Period. As you might have suspected, those pages are actually the script for Yakuza Sunset 4, Kusa. We're planning on using Bishumono Bridge in the film, so I went ahead to scout it out a bit. I see. Mm. Huh. You seem pretty down about all this, Sugano san. What's really the matter? It's this whole film. It's garbage. I have no idea how to proceed with it. I feel like I've lost my vision. What do you mean? Every day on the sunset, uh, set of Sunset 3 was like a dream. I loved it. I even stayed up all night editing the reel. For realsy. Everything seemed perfect. Till the movie debuted. Debuted? Debuted. It was like I have woken up from a dream to a real life nightmare. <sighs> Every forum on the net was in an uproar. Talking about how Sunset 3 was a disgrace to the franchise. They were calling for me to step down or worse. Oh, what's worse than stepping down? Stepping up? Hello. The internet sounds like a cruel place. The worst place was, a part was, once I calmed down and rewatched it, I agree with them. It was garbage. I don't know what I <laughs> deserve to direct another one. I gave them a best effort, but that just wasn't enough. I couldn't capture the magic of the old sunsets. It's got me thinking. If all I'm going to do is drag the series through the mud, maybe I should step down. Well, at least that explains what's got you so down, if you don't mind me asking. How'd you end up in the director's chair for the movie? And what happened to the original director? He retired to some far off corner of the earth. Nobody even knows where. But with the fan base Sunset has, the film company couldn't just let it die. So they chose me to head it up. <sighs> I was a huge fan. I found out the hard way that loving a movie as a fan and making one yourself are very different things. I knew it would be a challenge to live up to expectations and the hype, but I didn't expect to get eviscerated for my best efforts. If only I could replicate the old way the old director did things. But none of this is your problem, Kiri-san. Sorry for taking talking your ear off with this sub story. It's alright. I hope everything having I hope having someone to lend an ear help. I hope having someone to lend an ear helped. Yeah. Yeah. Well, the show must go on. I'll see you around, Kirisa. 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 Some of these girls just sitting in the corners. I think those are the minigame people. Poor guy is really struggling. Next time I'm at a video store, maybe I'll check out Yakuza Sunset 3. Ah, dark game. Yeah, don't care. We'll put it up on me. Time to watch Yakuza Sunset 3. They re -cousining. Is there a video store around here? Oh, there is. Just keep going. Actually, let's go this way. Whoa. A bit okay. Mm -hmm. 
That's him, Miyagi. One of the guys who kidnapped Miki. Hey, asshole. Hey, I remember you. That bitch cool up yet? She was out of her freaking mind, let me tell you. Do you know this girl? That's, uh, I mean, I've never seen her before. Might have been one of my customers over the club, but you can't expect me to remember every chick who sits with there, can you? Strange. I met someone who claims he conned her. Oh yeah, bring him here. Ain't nobody supposed to know about that. So you do know her. Where is she? <coughs> no fucking clue, man. I was just doing what Kajiwaru asked when I nabbed her. Crew could be anywhere by now. Last memory I got is tying her up and having some fun. Girl's got a great pair on her, believe me. Anyways, I don't know how you can connect it to all this, but it looks like I'm gonna have to shut you up for good. We're ready to die. Whoa. <laughs> Take that, Yagi. Boy. Tell me where Kajiwari is. Uh, I don't freaking know. Best kiss me be at the golf center. Guy's always got his clubs on him. Good, if you don't want to deal with me again, then I suggest you relocate. It's come like you don't belong on the streets. 